You'll notice that in United Sound, we teach rhythm before pitch. So we begin with flashcards. They look like this. Cake, soup, donut, and rest. Cake, of course, is the quarter note. Soup represents a half note. Donuts represent two eighth notes. And a quarter note rest is simply rest. These are all the rhythms that you'll find in book one, and new musicians all around the country have had great success with them. There's an important spatial element here that you probably noticed too. The soup is the same length as two cakes, and two donuts take up as much space as one cake as well. Watch as Micah explains it to his mentors. These two are little deaf fish. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Would you say that there's two of these in each one of these? Yeah. A hot Because see how these two are little and this one big. Yeah. So this, this one. This one is longer, so this is a longer one. And that's yeah. exactly what they sound like. Exactly. And these are these two ones are shown. Yes, exactly. Wasn't that great? That was Micah's first day of United Sound 2. So let's try some of these rhythms together. Remember, don't clap. Take a look at the cakes, donuts, and soup before you. Think about it. Let's give it a try. One, two. Ready, go. Cake, cake, donut, rest, soup, rest, cake. All right, that was fantastic. Good job. Give each other a high five. Make sure you celebrate. Let's try it one more time. One, two, ready, go. Cake, cake, donut, rest, soup, rest, cake. Awesome job! Yay! Now is the time to create the celebration habit. Every time you perform or play something, give a whoop and a high five to someone today. As we're learning these rhythms, can you imagine how hand over hand might be a good strategy to use for connecting the flashcards to their meanings? Are you ready to try another one? Take a good look! Okay, here we go. One, two, ready, go. Cake, rest. Donut, cake. Donut, donut, soup. Great job. Give each other high fives. Let's try it one more time. You're on your own this time. Ready, go. Next, let's watch as this chapter president explains a very simple flashcard activity to her group. The most important thing you can do early on is to create a safe, no-fail environment. You can outright tell your new musician the answer if he needs it, and then celebrate. So now that we learned what each of the flashcards is, you're going to take two, pick any two, and put them on the stand in front of your new musician and say one of the two flashcards and have your new musician identify which one that is. And I put these two in front of my new musician, if you guys can see them, and I say cake, and your new musician has to identify which one is cake, and they would point at this one. So do that and mix with the flashcards, do that a couple times, okay? 